Here's the new worm harvester. It's built with some 20 inch uh, bicycle rims by one and three quarter. Uh, powered by a half inch drill pulley system. A uh, split five gallon bucket is a ramp. It's a dual screen. This one is a one eighth screen and it runs down into a quarter inch screen with varying buckets. It is on uh, little wheels down here and we've also uh, included a uh, makeshift type of uh, lift so we can adjust the height of it. All I'm going to do is <clears throat> sift some material, bedding material out. just need a little bit for another holding bed for some red wigglers so we can weigh them out a lot easier come on uh, Monday. Um, and it's easier to screen the material so that it uh, screens real nice. Basically, the material I'll use for some Alabama jumpers and all. Basically, this clumpy stuff right here. It's got a bunch of clumps, you can hear it. I'll have some finer material here and some real fine here. Now, this one wasn't pre sifted, so you'll see a mix. Give you an idea. Run. Now, of course, you don't want the worm that fast. You're going real slow. You're losing power, so I'll keep it up a little bit. Get started. bedding material I'm using is uh, kind of clumpy, but you can see we got a bunch of worms right here. So I'll clean that out. Down here, we got the nice clean castings. And over here, I left with some bigger debris. We'll have some little worms and cocoons in there. That's about it. 